Meh. Good afternoon, welcome to another episode of Deer Outdoors. It is currently nine minutes after three, We're running a little bit late this afternoon. I was supposed to be out in the woods planning around six o'clock in the morning. Uh, had some stuff to take care of this morning, but that's all right. We're headed out to the field right now. Gonna be hunting does. Uh, Michigan just opened their early doe season. It's September 16th. Um, so we are headed out to a little section on our property. Um, kind of a swampy area that the deer like to travel through to their bedding area. And then in the evenings, they'll be headed out to feed. So hopefully this afternoon, we're gonna get on the ground. I have my bow with me. We're going to settle into a little ground spot and hopefully we're gonna see some deer and possibly put one on the ground. Stay tuned and enjoy the video. GoPro has maybe says it has four percent left, so I didn't really record anything else after the uh, last encounter with the deer that we had. Um, I left there around eight o'clock. Down in the swamp, it was too dark to shoot, so I figured I'd jump up into the fields and maybe get a chance to walk a tree line and get close to a deer. But I saw another five deer in the field. Couldn't get close enough to get a shot. Um, but got to see some deer. None came where we needed them to. And didn't get a shot, but sometimes that's how it goes. Um, getting ready, I'm gonna drive over to a spot. I have a camera up and pull the card. Had it out for six days. Uh, see what's on it and uh, drive home. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, we'll catch you on another video. Seems to have a lot more. You can 
see in the background behind you. Anything that's like yellowish orange leaves. That's all oak. And it has a lot of oak. And it's flat over here. The most out of any spot on this piece of state. Which obviously means a lot more acorns, a lot more brows. But yesterday, last night, it was, it was too rainy to hunt and make a shot with a bow, you know, and be able to recover with a good conscience. But I took the advantage of the rain and the wind to scout without making too much scent or noise impact. And I found this spot. So I settled in here. We're at the scene of the crime. We're gonna go in. I don't know if it's bad luck to take a gut and knife on a track job, but we're gonna go in and see. I got my brother Kurt here for some support. There he is, the legend. All right, we're gonna take up the track. I'm gonna turn my Onyx on. Blood. 
Oh yeah, right here. See this track? Yep. Yeah, you were. I was just trying to do due diligence yep. until you found something. Lots of blood here. Lots of blood. Lots of blood. He's opening up now. That track right there and blood right there. Mm -hmm. oh. This is from his nose. Told you that's from how much. How much blood? Can't can't be much further. Right here. He's bleeding like a stuck pig. How is he carrying it that far? Is this us pushing them right now? No. Found him. Man, he toted it a long way. What do we have? It's not a big buck. It's not the big one we were hoping for, no. but that's okay. I'll tell you what, my uh, my salute to this guy. He toted that thing a long way. Where'd you hit him? On the other side. That's a big buck. I told you that was a big body deer, that second one that came in. That's a pretty unique looking buck. That's something we had on the camera. Yeah. Pretty buck. Isn't that really cool though? Yeah. You go there? Is it working? It wasn't going far. You see where it came out? Out the front. got it. We got it. Get the best of both worlds. We killed the buck this morning and the big one lives on. So pretty cool, pretty fun. Glad for my grandpa. That's a big body deer. Almost as heavy horned as it is. As heavy horned as it was. 
bodied as it was. I almost want to say it was a two-year-old deer with not much antlers. So now the old biggin, the old biggin's still out there. So that gives us something to look forward to. So until next time, thanks for watching and we'll catch you on another video. Well, a couple hours later, there's the there's the tenderloin. So we're doing it justice over breakfast. So now the video can officially conclude. 